<laughs> okay, so all right. So what I was going to show you then is this video I made yesterday with Max, where we're looking at circuit diagrams pretty much for the first time, like real actual circuit diagrams that are just symbols, no pictures of the of the components or anything. And you know, someone could go look at that. The videos on the on our co-founders playlist or Technotutor co-founder kids playlist. Yeah. Um, but what I was going to show you is this is really cool. So we made that video yesterday, like in the afternoon, right? Because you can see in the video, it's still light outside, right? And then there's this one part, I'm going to share my screen with you real quick. Oh, give me permission okay. to share. Sure. Just going to make you the host. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, let's see. It says you are the host now. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so this is just like a, a still of that video, right? Yeah. And this is the screen like that it was on at this part of the video. And at this okay. part of the video, he, we're looking at this. I think it, I had pretty much just pulled it up, if I'm not mistaken, or I don't know if we had really gone over much. Let me see. Oh, no, we had. We had gone over like most of it because when he looked at this part here, can you see my mouse? Yep. When I, when I asked him about this, I said, what do you think that is? And he said, nine volt battery. Yeah, that's awesome. Like, I never showed him that that's what it is. You see what I mean? Yeah. Um, and this is, oh yeah, this is the part. So it didn't have the rectangles. It has the, because I was telling you, I thought it was the rectangles, but other diagrams have rectangles, but he knew that was the resistors. Cause that symbol is on his components, but then he right. knew that was a hundred thousand ohms. There's that's a certain cool. part in the video where I'm asking him about this. And I think, I don't think it's on this one, but it's on another diagram and it has this symbol here, but it has a T next to it. So he says it's a transformer. Yeah. And I was like, okay, but I know it says T and transformer starts with T. That's why you're saying that. But look at the symbol itself. What do you think it is based on the symbol? And he was like, a transistor. Yeah. So he uh, like nice. knows the transistor. Because if you look at the, dot, the symbol, it, it means something, right? Yeah. But what was really cool is at a certain point in the video, you'll see he like goes and lets the dog in. And then he comes back. And then we're like looking at it again. And he points at this, this part right here. Okay. And he goes, what is that? Yeah. And I go, and I go, I don't know. I said, you know, I, I don't know. We can maybe look that up. Or I, I think I just said, I don't, I'm not really actually sure what it is, Max, but um, what do you think about this one? Cause I just had no idea. I said, I'm not sure what it is. Cause it just looked yeah. to me when I looked at it, I was like, no idea. Right. Just right. looks like a bunch of business right there. You know, I know every, I know pretty much what everything else is, right. He knew this was a diode. Right. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Right. And then we figured out what these little arrows mean right? That's when it's an LED. It adds those arrows because that's the light that's being emitted. So we explained uh, that. It's just really cool. We had a really cool conversation about understanding all this stuff because we had, I think we looked that up later. But anyways, he asked me about this thing and I was just like, I don't know. And then the video we go on and we look at like, you know, other things, right? We're just like, it's just kind of the video is just us talking about different stuff like that. And he's reading all this stuff, right? So that was kind of cool. cool. Yeah. But what's really cool is um, last night when we were in bed, okay, uh -huh. he wanted to watch, cause I always like, sometimes at night we'll, we'll watch videos like when we're, you know, laying in bed or just like, he's like eating a snack or something like that. And then we always watch little videos, but we don't watch TV or anything like that. Yeah. Right. We don't ever watch anything stimulating. It's just like, so his options lately have been, do you want to watch something about ceramics, something about wood turning, you know, like the wood turning where they like carve it. Yeah. Um, like repairing or restoring some kind of metal or something like that yeah. or some kind of cooking thing. We'll watch like cool, like videos of people cooking something. Right. That's so cool. we're just watching stuff like that. Right. Yeah. And then last night he asked me to watch something about like circuits. Right. So okay. I just happened to find this guy and I'm not even sure why I clicked on this exactly this video, but this was the video we watched. Okay. And I think, I think it might be because, well, actually, I don't know why. But in any case, we watched, started watching this, right? And he starts explaining this thing, right? And then I'm realizing from watching it, although I didn't make the connection right away, that this is that thing we were looking at. Oh. Okay, and I didn't realize at the time because it doesn't look exactly the same. Like, if you were to compare it. Yeah, because like, um, like you said, here, it's got the rectangles for the resistor instead of the... But I mean, line. even this, like, five, four, two, six, eight. Yeah, it's, it's, it's like a different um, setup. Yeah, for sure. Right. And yeah, these are also different in two and everything. So, so we watched this video on this 555 timer 
And then we started watching more videos on the 556. Because apparently it's like the most common integrated circuit in a lot of electronics because it, it does a lot of different things. It has a lot of applications. So we watched like probably three or four of this guy's videos and a bunch of other stuff. Um, and we just, I mean, of this guy's stuff. And he's just a really cool engineer who explains electronics and he shows you how to build them. And then, you know, he even shows you like the actual process of putting it together to do something and all that, right? Okay. Well, anyway, so that's last night, right? That's like three or four, maybe even, well, five or six hours actually after the other thing. So we watched some of these, we went to bed, got up this morning, Katie came down much later because she wanted to sleep in a little bit because she was up all night with Seneca. So I was down with the kids. And then around like maybe an hour or so ago, um, mm -hmm. I was downstairs getting ready to come up here in the office. And Katie was watching that video from last night, the one where it's me and him looking at the diagrams. And I overheard mm -hmm. that part where I heard myself in the video saying, I don't, I don't know what that is. He asked me like, what is that? And I said, I don't know. And I was, and I realized in that moment, like, oh, wait, I know what that is now. I just, it's like, I just knew because I could process it because we'd learned about it. Right. Okay. So I was like, Katie, pause the video. So I go in there and she's sitting next to him watching it. Right. And I said, pause the video. And I put it back and I said, Max, what is that? And he looks at it and then he looks at her and he goes, that's a five, five, five timer. <laughs> <laughs> that's so cool. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> but I mean, how did I know that's what it was? Yeah. Cause I understood like we watched the videos. It, it made sense. Like I made the, my, my processing, it made the connection. Yeah. Cause I'm not like watching this video of this five, five timer, five, five, five timer and going, I don't know what this is. This is too complicated. Like, even though I don't know, it, I never heard of it before. Right. You know what I mean, like I, I haven't studied electronics per se. Yeah. You know? So it was just really cool because I saw within that just the point of, you know, he's learning in the same way I would like, yeah. meaning like I would, I have the vocabulary. I watch something. It makes sense that I'm able to do something with it. And right. he did that as well. And so um, I just wanted to share that, that point. I'm going to pause the recording here. Okay.